Hi guys, John Winder with Sidewinder Painting, and uh, so we're wrapping up uh, our prep day today here, and about to head home. You know, on the on the great sands of the Tatooine Desert here. But uh, I wanted to talk to you about something in the trades that's it's not really talked about a lot, and that's especially in painting is is honor. You know, a lot of tradesmen talk about the idea of pride, taking pride in your work, and and that's not good enough. You need to have a sense of sense of honor and uh you know what does that mean what does that entail and um well you, you look back at the the imperial era japan the, the japanese officers they they carried swords with them and that was to instill a sense of honor in what they did and uh well, what, what does that have to do with it right why did, why did the japanese officers carry swords well, well, why did honor mean so much to them <laughs> they, they had to carry a sword with yeah. Well, so, you know, when you when you make a mistake, sometimes part of that, you know, growing up and being a man is you, you have to atone for your errors and try and make things right. So what I instruct all my crew members to do is, you know, if, if you make a really egregious mistake that you need to atone for, you, t you take out your 5-in-1. And, and, and guys, if you don't have your 5-in-1 on you, just, you, you, everything's, everything's foobar. Like, if you don't have a 5-in-1 on you, just just contact the military have them glass the area there's been a, a top to bottom failure just have them utilize a tactical nuclear weapon just glass everything You're, the people who hired you fucked up the owners fucked up uh the general contractor your parents everybody <laughs> just just have them glass the area with some tactical nuclear weapons and hopefully like a phoenix rising from the ashes something better will come out of that but if you don't have your five and one on you it's it's already it's, it's too late but the japanese officers when when they did something that they needed to atone for that was so egregious like in in our trade you know it could, it could be something like you know using the wrong color tape where it wasn't supposed to go or adding a wrong sheen paint to flat or or the worst using silicone caulking where it wasn't supposed to go so what you do is same thing the japanese officers did your five one and don't don't even go for the razor knife no you already tried to take the quick and easy route and it didn't work and this is your atonement and just like the japanese officers you plunge it deep into your guts and you cut across and that's that's the only way that you're going to be able to restore honor to your to your trade 